In this video, we're gonna cover top 10 site for learning more about ethical hacking with free in 2022. Hey, it's John here from Top 10. We are to help you to know top, amazing and best things. If you see value in this video, make sure give like and subscribe. It's really make huge difference. Let's jump into it. You'll see the difference now. All link is on description, don't forget to look them. If you want to learn ethical hacking and looking for free resources like online training courses and tutorials, then you have come to the right place. We are doing share free ethical hacking courses for you. Most of us have even a little bit of knowledge about the subject or industry that would be ideal if you start a career in that field, but the problem for most people is finding the right course or program that help you master these skills and become professional in the field and click on this article likely shows that you are interested in ethical hacking. Ethical hacking sometimes is known as penetration testing is a process followed by a hacker to exploit a vulnerability inside a system. And that system could be computers such as Windows, Linux, Macos, or maybe websites. The first is Penetration Testing Lab. This blog is regularly updated as of this writing. New posts are published approximately once every couple of weeks. Posts are organized in a variety of categories including social engineering, mobile pen testing, general lab notes, exploitation techniques, and coding. Here are a few of our favorite posts on this site. The first my favorite is Phishing Windows Credentials. This blog post covers using C-Hash. Metasploit and Windows PowerShell to acquire usernames and passwords in networks that use Windows Server and Windows 10. These are the most popular operating systems in office environments, so what you learn here will be useful in a lot of your pen testing work. The second my favorite is using Metasploit to create a war backdoor. This guide is for more advanced web application pen testing. A backdoor allows an external cyber attacker to acquire internal access to their target. You'll learn to simulate more complex web hacks in this post. The third and my final favorite is pen testing SQL servers with Nmap. SQL servers drive the backends of a lot of the web applications and online services that you use every day. Finding SQL server vulnerabilities is really sophisticated stuff. There's a lot of harm a cyber attacker can do if they acquire malicious access to a SQL server, such as a breach of sensitive financial data. The second is Pentester Lab Blog. This is a medium hosted blog that's operated by Pentester Lab. Every few months, there's a new post that's full of insight. We recommend that you explore the blog's older articles. Two, here are some of my favorites. The first my favorite is Invest in QA. This article explains why companies should spend time and money on quality assurance teams in their application development. If applications are security tested before they're deployed in production environments, a lot of vulnerabilities and cyber attacks can be avoided. The second and my last favorite is for easy capture the flag challenges. This article explains some exercises exercises people can try when they design their own capture the flag CTF competition CTF is a type of hacking game where you explore an application or network to capture a flag such as a script or a line of code. This article explains some exercises people can try when they design their own capture the flag competitions. CTF is a type of hacking game where you explore an application or network to capture a flag such as a script or a line of code. The third is so you want to be a pen tester when dancing only causes embarrassment. Give pen testing a go. Jack Halon lists a large number of useful resources that you can use to explore pen testing further. Jack also provides an overview of some of the technical skills that you'll need to have as a pen tester. Web app security is very important. Chances are that today you've already used some web apps, Facebook, Twitter, Amazon, and so on. A lot of the big data breaches in the news that you'll hear about are from exploited web vulnerabilities. The fourth is ScienceSoft. ScienceSoft is a US-based mobile app development company that covers end-to-end -end implementation of B2B, B2C, and enterprise mobile solutions for retail, healthcare, banking, manufacturing, etc. Ensuring smooth UX and trendy UI, ScienceSoft's app developers deliver mobile and progressive web apps of various complexity, hacking, including software with R, VR, AI, image recognition, telehealth, machine learning, IoT, and text-to-speech features. The 
fifth is Raxus. Raxus is a full-service penetration testing company providing PTAS, every type of pentest, and red teaming. Raxus was founded in 2011 by Mark Puckett, an Atlanta information security expert who saw a burning need for more realistic penetration testing. Many larger companies claimed to do pentests, but few were doing it right and none were doing it very well. The sixth is HackerOne. HackerOne was started by hackers and security leaders who are driven by a passion to make the internet safer. Their platform is the industry standard for hacker-powered security. They partner with the global hacker community to surface the most relevant security issues of their customers before they can be exploited by criminals. At HackerOne, we're making the internet a safer place. Thousands of talented people, hackers, employees, and community members. Their purpose is hacking for good. The seventh and my favorite is latest hacking news. Latestthinkingnews.com was formed as part of a collaboration of experts specializing in networking, forensics, programming, and ethical hacking. The team each have many years' experience in their specific fields. Our belief is to provide informative news and thought-provoking content. The eighth is HackRed. HackRed is a news platform that centers on InfoSec cybercrime, privacy, surveillance, and hacking news with full-scale reviews on social media platforms and technology trends. They provide daily updates and newsworthy information regarding major modern-day changes, risks, and tools related to it and computer security. Founded in 2011, HackRead is based in the United Kingdom. The ninth and my second favorite is Hacking Articles. Hacking Articles team is working day and night in order to provide you with correct and easily understandable articles. They are all about giving the power of knowledge to each and every cybersecurity enthusiast around the globe. Hacking Articles is a comprehensive source of information on cybersecurity, ethical hacking, penetration testing, and other topics of interest to information security professionals. You'll find tools, resources, and tutorials on everything The tenth is e-hacking. Secure technology infrastructure through quality education create future information and cybersecurity professionals' education for everyone, everywhere. E-hacking is the world's best platform to learn cybersecurity, ethical hacking, Kali Linux, OSINT, and other relevant to information security topics. Thanks for watching this article so far. If you like these free ethical hacking online courses, then please share them with your friends and colleagues. If you have any questions or feedback, then please drop a comment. And which one is best for you? Drop on the comment.